Hi, I'm Minister Ralph Friedrichs. Making a difference is my belief. Here is my challenge to everyone. I just want to challenge everyone, a challenge I'm also trying to live out. No matter how busy you are, there is always something you can do to brighten someone's day. Give someone a hug. Send a text with an inspiring quote. Friends, mail a heartfelt card. Tell someone how much you appreciate him or her. If we look, each day presents us with opportunities to share kindness throughout the world. My core belief that we are called to not only love God and love people, but to carry out the Great Commission and share the eternal message of Jesus Christ. My goal is to help you reimagine your life and let go of the thoughts and behaviors that undermine you so that a renewed and fulfilled you can emerge starting today. We must love one another as God loves each and every one of us. To be able to love, we, my friends, need a clean heart. Prayer is what gives us a clean heart. The fruit of prayer is deepening of faith, and the fruit of faith is love. I hope each and every one of you remember to show compassion and have a a great life ahead of you with Jesus Christ. Good morning, good morning. My name is Ralph Fridericks. I am an author and addiction recovery coach, a life coach, a minister, and the host of this show, the Take Your Life Back Today radio show. You can see a video version of this if you go to YouTube under channel, Take Your Life Back Today show. Uh, we are now in a different uh, area uh, in our ministry here, and uh, I want to kind of each day go somewhere different to show you what we are. But friends, listen, we must remember that God's end game for our lives is not necessarily our happiness as much as our holiness. Do you understand that? He is molding you and me, us, into the image of his son, Jesus Christ. Sometimes that requires times of pain and heartache in our lives. So for those who are going through times of difficulty right now, Be reminded that God has allowed it for his purposes, for his purpose. It is these hard moments that we must learn to trust him 100%. There's a uh, family I know that has trusted God through great difficulties, the loss of their wife and mother. God can use hardship to accomplish uh, his what we consider a disruption to our lives and really part of our God's good plan. It is all in his, his plan to make these things happen. And sometimes we struggle to get stronger. Call me, 844-405-HELP. Together we can help each other take our lives back. Remember, friends, God truly loves you and God is waiting for you to reach out to him. I hope you got to see some of the background in one of my other areas here at our ministry. And we look forward to tomorrow going into the little uh, outside areas. May God bless you and we will talk to you tomorrow.